tier list. We're gonna get this, we're gonna get it going right now, ready? Starting with A and W. Okay. Now. Can I be honest with you? I've had A and W like once in my life, just once. And I don't remember what it was. So it wasn't it wasn't memorable enough for me. Um It wasn't memorable enough for me. So, I mean, so I'm just uh, A and W. I mean, they like burgers and fries, right? Burgers and fries. I think I think we just I think we just. I it, it wasn't bad. I don't even know if there's an A and W around us. Do they even make these anymore? I, I'm just gonna go. You know, I just have to go with never had. I have to go with never had because I can't judge it on like when I was like. Five, six. I don't even think they make them anymore. So I'm just gonna go with A and W. Never had Arby's. Absolute garbage. Straight up. I don't care what you say. I do not care what you say. Arby's is not good on any planet surface whatsoever. I'm sorry. I'm sorry for my Arby lovers. Listen, y'all have that. It's all y'all. Y'all enjoy it. You know. You do what you gotta do. But I, for one, am not going to be taking an Arby's. I'm just not. I'm sorry. Okay. Uh, that's Arby's. Baja Fresh. So, fun fact, I had Baja Fresh uh, when I went to Vegas. It was in the hotel we were at. And it was actually pretty good. I'm not going to lie. Like, everything there was good. Quesadillas were good. They make authentic Mexican food. Uh, the breakfast burrito we had was fire. Absolute gas. Uh, Baja Fresh isn't, isn't bad at all. I would put Baja Fresh in like a, like a B tier. It wasn't bad. It really wasn't bad at all. Baja Fresh was, was pretty good. And oh, that's good. All right, Blimpies. I've never had Blimpies. I don't even know what that is. That's a sub shop. Okay. Bojangles. I don't think I've had Bojangles. I've heard, the name sounds familiar, but I haven't had Bojangles. What does it have? Chicken? If there's some around me, maybe we can do that for like a like a fast food uh, review, like a food review. Boston Market. No, never been there either. What are these places? Blimpy, Boston Market, Bojangles, bro? Like, what are we talking about? I don't know. Next, Burger King. Oh my gosh, Burger King. Can I be honest, chat? <laughs> I don't like Burger King, man. I do not think Burger King is it. Can I, I'm just gonna flat out say it. I don't think it's it, man. Uh, I would say it's trash. I'm not, I'm not gonna go that low to say it's trash, but it's not like, like I would take Baja Fresh over Burger King every day. So I think Burger King's gonna get our first C. It's gonna get our first C. Okay, next, Raising Cane's. So, fun fact, I just had Raising Cane's probably like 30 minutes before the stream started. And Raising Cane's is so good. The box combo, the sandwich combo, you can get whatever you want. I don't know if it's the best, but it's definitely in the A category. Cane's is so good. I, I could eat Cane's every other day if I wanted to. The, the the little the toaster the not the toaster the whatever it's called the bread that they give you and stuff it's good the fries I like the crinkle cut fries those are good the the sauce that they give you the cane sauce all that stuff is good man cane's is good it definitely belongs in the eight it belongs in eight tier Carl's Jr. um die I guess nothing ah it's all right it's all right it's all right. Like, it's nothing to brand, run home, and tell your friends about. But, eh, like, it's, it's like, okay. Again, that's one of those that I'll eat it, sure. If, it, if we're, like, you know, on a road trip and all they have is a Carl Jr. and I'm super hungry, I'll eat it. You know what I'm saying? Same thing with Burger King. Road trip, oh, I have Burger King in there, I'll eat it. That's what, <laughs> that's what the seat tier, that's what the seat tier list is. That's what it is. Checkers. Checkers is actually pretty good. I don't think I'm gonna throw it in A though. I'd probably throw it. Uh, Checkers is good. Above Baja. I'll do a solid B. 
I will give it A. I'll do a solid B for that. I will. Chakras is really, really good. Ah, uh, but I gotta go A? No, I'm not. But like, I mean, I think we all, I mean, I think we all know where this is, right? Like, let's just, let's just not even beat around the bush. Let's just not even beat around the bush. Chick-fil-A is the best, <laughs> is the best food I have had. Like, no one's pretty much top of Chick-fil-A. Everybody loves Chick-fil-A. The, the nuggets are good. And matter of fact, I was gonna get Chick-fil-A today, but I decided not to. I should've, though. I really should've. The sauce is good. The different type of elements you can get um, from the Chick-fil-A. Polynesian sauce, the chicken nuggets, bro. All this stuff is good. I have no complaints with Chick-fil-A. I can get Chick-fil-A pretty much any day, except Sunday. Which would probably be the only complaint. But, uh, yeah, no, 100%, 100%. Chick-fil-A, man. <laughs> Chipotle, 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 Chipotle. Chipotle is my life. Chipotle is really good, too. And it's better than all these. I'm having a hard time between it being the best and A. I'm trying to see if it's better than Kane's. Chipotle is really good. Like, let's, let's just be real. Chipotle is really good. If you had Chipotle, then I don't know what you're doing yet, you need to have it. It's, it's good. You should get the burrito. They have, uh, what other stuff do they have? They have the quesadilla that they have, that they just recently had. Um, you can get like a burrito bowl. You can get uh, the tacos that they have. Oh, it's in the A tier, but I just don't know if it's better than Kane's. Is it better than Kane's? Is Chipotle better than Kane's? I don't think so. I don't think so. Chipotle is definitely A though. It's up there. Church's chicken, dude. Church's chicken. Uh, after church, right, we would always, a mom pops, whatever, would always get like a huge ass box of whatever, just like thighs, whites, darts, whatever. Legs, we're gonna call it Church's chicken and fries. And that's what we would have Honestly, on a consistent basis, it was like churches, churches, churches. Every this like not like every day, but it's like every Sunday. It was like churches, churches, churches. Maybe we'll switch it up and go to McDonald's, back to churches, McDonald's. You know what I'm saying? Da, 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 da. It was, and I've had my fair share of churches. Um, Cause I'm telling you, I'm like what 26 now. I haven't had churches chicken since I was like maybe 12, 13. Was I still eating churches at like 13 years old? Maybe. Which is like 13 years ago, so like it's eager to I'm eager to see how that'll be. Uh, I will go with churches uh, above Burger King. I'll go C tier for churches because when it comes to chicken, right? Like look at what you're going up against. Is Popeyes on here? Popeyes has to be on here. Popeyes is on here. You know what I'm saying? Like you're going up against some heavy hitters. Like you're good, but you're not the best. All right, next cookout. I have not had the thing called cookout. Del Taco. I haven't had Del Taco either. That sounds familiar though. Culver's. <laughs> Culver's is good. Culver's is good. I, but, <laughs> Culver's is good. Culver's is good. I would take Culver's over Checkers. I would take Culver's over Checkers. Culver's will be B. And that's all she wrote for that, okay? Covers is great. And listen, when you see this list, don't come from my neck. But if you can come from my neck, come correct, bro. Come correct, all right? That's all I say. Denny's, uh. Denny's is good, but it's like, like, I don't know, man. Denny's, like, Denny's is okay. Like, for breakfast. I, I, I just, mm. Uh, yeah. Or Checkers, or Culver's, no way, not there. Is it better than Church's Chicken? I'll say yes for now, just because I haven't had Church's in so long, I don't know if it's still good. I'd rather eat Diddy's and Church's Chicken and Burger King, Carver's Jr. and stuff like that, but other than that, no. Domino's. You know why I put Domino's here? I'm gonna tell you why I'm putting Domino's here, okay? <laughs> 
Domino's pizza is literally the best pizza on the planet. And I will die on this hill. And I'm not biased, right? I'm not biased because I used to work at Domino's. No. I just know Domino's pizza is good. And think about the deals that you have. You can get a mix and match for $5.99 each, bro. At Pizza Hut, you can't even do that. They don't have any deals like that, bro. Pizza Hut be taxing. They be taxing you. They be charging you an arm and a leg for that. An arm and a leg for a pizza, bro. When you can get damn near two pizzas for like $12. Are you serious? And the, and the, and the, 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 the complimentary stuff, right? You can get the cheesy bread. You can get the stuffed jalapeno cheesy bread. You can get wings. You can get a bunch of other stuff, right? Sandwiches. Bro, you got all that, dude. Oh, people must love Domino's. I will down the sale. Domino's is really, really, really good. And it's A tier, 100%. I actually think it's better than Chipotle. And that's just me being not healthy. Not better than Kenzo. All right, DQ. DQ. That's what I like about Texas. For not for nothing, DQ is... I'm eating DQ over checkers. I am. Dairy Queen is good. I'm not taking it over Culver's. Culver's is really, really good. Um, but nah, DQ is... It, it gets the job done, right? Like the belt buster and... Um, the, the little that when you turn you turn it around and you do all that you do all that stuff what is it called a blizzard a blizzard that's what it's called the blizzards are good everything's nice Dairy Queen is good right there where it is in a B category not over Culver's I don't think anything's gonna be Culver's because Culver's is like a low A that's what I gotta say Pollo Loco can I be honest with you El Pollo Loco is right here El Pollo Loco oh no 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 I like is that El Pollo Loco or El Pollo Rico? Hold on. If that's the case, then this is above Culver's 100%. This place is so good. They have a half, they have a half chicken. Like, you can get half a chicken. And they also have your typical sides and everything, right? Like your, uh, what is it called? Like you get your rice, obviously you get your beans, you can get fries if you want. And they have a quesadilla that's banging. El Pollo Loco is so good. I would recommend that to anybody. And I think we should probably get that for our next food review. I think El Pollo Rico or El Pollo Loco, whatever, one of the two, I think they're one and the same. We should get that. Uh, okay, Firehouse Subs. Firehouse Subs is also good as well. Not over Culver's, but over DQ, 100%. Firehouse Subs, my dad put me on game with this. I've never been there before. And it's like fire, like it's firemen, firefighter, like related and stuff. And I'm like, okay, this is weird, but cool. Founded by firemen. Yeah. Founded by firemen. But okay, that's pretty cool. And, uh, you know, I had it. And honestly, those, those, those subs are banging. All right, here we go. Five Guys. Damn, dude. I'm not going to lie to you. Five Guys is good at, it's good as hell. It's good as hell. Um, it's just expensive, dude. Five Guys might argue, I, I think I kind of want to leave Five Guys up at the top. I think Five Guys is up there with the best because I, dude, what I'm telling you, their burgers, oh, and then the fries. Dude, they have seasoned fries. You can get fries seasoned however you want them, bro. However you want them. And the burgers are like this fat and big. Look at this, chat. You see this? That's a fat burger. So good. Yeah, it's crazy. But it's worth it. Five Guys might be the best. Oh, man. I don't know. It's better than Cane's. It's way... It's, it's better than Cane's. Um, I'm going to go with... Just just know that, okay? I can kill Five Guys in top of one. Wait. I'm not going to kill Five Guys. Like, five actual people. Let's just keep going. All right. Okay. I hop. Huh. I hop is okay. Like, it, it's one of those where it gets the job done. It's better than Denny's. But it's like, I don't know. I have... <laughs> Am I putting on the same tier as Denny's? No, I won't. I thought I have on a B tier just because it's better than Denny's a little bit. But, like, I don't... I don't know, man. in and out Burger. Trash. Okay. Now, I know this is going to be terrible for some of you 
And you know what? It's going to be hard for you guys to realize this as well. But it needs to be said, okay? It needs to be said. And y'all can come for me in the comments whenever y'all want. I don't care, okay? in and out Burger is trash, bro. It's not good whatsoever. All my Californians, whatever, y'all can say whatever. It is garbage. It's literally garbage. The fries are like cardboard plastic fries, okay? The burgers are like mid. I'm sorry, in and out is not. What else do they have to offer? Mid burgers with cardboard fries. You want me to call that good? No, I'm sorry. And I will down and say, I'll fight anybody in the comments. I will fight anybody in the comments. I don't care. In and out burger is not good. It's not good. Let's just call it what it is. Call it spade a spade. Trash to trash. Okay? Jack in the Box. Uh, Jack in the Box is okay. It's, it's like right here. Better than Denny's. Um, yeah. Jack in the Box is okay. Jersey Mike's. I don't think I've had Jersey Mike's subs. I want to go try it though. People didn't tell me to come try it out. But I, I don't know. I don't know. I want to... I'll check it out at a different time. Jimmy John's. I will put Jimmy John's up there with Firehouse subs, but at the back of Firehouse subs. Uh, like, Firehouse for, like, a sub sandwich, for, like, an actual sub sandwich, Jimmy John's is pretty good. Pretty damn good. I'm not going to lie. Jolly Bee. I've never heard or been a Jolly Bee. Never heard of that. KFC. Uh... Man, KFC. Okay. Well, um, I don't really go to KFC like that. Um, and I don't know why. It's just, it's not on my radar. That's not to say it's trash, but it's not on my radar for chicken spots, right? Like, I would actually, so I'm it's somewhere between, like, it's, am I taking churches over KFC is the question. You know what I mean? Nah. I'm sorry. Honestly, even Carl's Jr.'s. Sorry, KFC. You might have to go to the back. I'm sorry. None of these uh, Caesars is next. Um, yeah, Little Caesars. I don't want to say it's trash because in college, I would get the little $5 hot and ready's and they'd be, they'd be banging sometimes, but it's not good. I would have KFC over Little Caesars. It's definitely going to be in the C tech category. Um, Long John Silver's. I actually hear... It's not good. I'm sorry. Long John Silver's is not it. And granted, I haven't had it in a while. But when I did have it, I didn't enjoy it. So, um, and I don't even know if they're still in business. Is Long John Silver's still in business? Next. I've never been to Moe's. Noodles Eat Company. I haven't been there either. McDonald's. Man. So, I was a McDonald's fan, bro, for the longest time. And that's all I ate. And and because now listen, no listen, listen, chat. Hold on, 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 hold on. Hold on, hold on. I know McDonald's is bad for you. I know it. Okay? I know, I know this already. And matter of fact, I haven't even eaten McDonald's at all this year. And we're in August. Okay? It is like McDonald's fries are the best. Let's just let's just get that out of the way real quick. So that's the best fry on the planet. Different countries, bro, they, they serve different stuff at, at the at the McDonald's. So like it's it's and it's like it's arguably the best just because of the food they have. Even though it's so bad for you, I think it's the best. It has to be the best. It's up there with the Chick-fil-A is in the five guys of the world. It's like McDonald's is, is there. Express. Panda is actually pretty good. I'm not going to lie to you. I'm not going to throw it in the A tier. I'm going to throw it in a high B. Because Panda, for Chinese food, like, you want, like, something quick and fast for Panda Express, you can get that, bro. I literally had the honey walnut shrimp with fried rice, and uh, you can get the Beijing beef, or you can get the orange chicken, whatever. But it's good, and it gets the job done. It gets the job done. You want that little Chinese fill? It gets the job done. Here, 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 here. It's uh, it's like right here. Let's look at this. Panera Bread. Panera Bread has good mimosas, and that's all I remember from Panera Bread. Um, <laughs> I don't even know what kind of food. I'm just going to go with... Panera has good mimosas, dude. I don't know what else they serve, though. What else do they serve? What else do they serve at Panera Bread? Cookies and brownies. I don't even, you know, pastries. No. 
I mean, some of the stuff looks good, but no. He's... Okay, mac and cheese looks pretty good. Broccoli cheddar soup. Uh, that could be good. Homestyle chicken noodle soup. Eh, okay. The corn chowder. I don't know about that. Cream of chicken. Creamy tomato soup. Chicken tikka masala. Okay. That could be, that could be good. That could be good right there. That could be really good. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Papa John's, trash, absolute trash, garbage, bottom of the barrel pizza. Will never eat Papa John's in my life. Worse than In-N-Out, <laughs> I'm kidding. Uh, Papa John's would be, it's in the trash category, but it's the best trash. Ah, uh, okay, Papa John's isn't trash, fine. But uh, C, if, if, if Papa John's was the only pizza left on the planet, I would eat it. There, you happy? PDQ, I've never had. Penn Station, never had. Pizza Hut. So this is where I'm gonna start some fights. This is where the fights start happening. Because, <laughs> oh my gosh, Pizza Hut is good. But remember how I said earlier about the food, and, not the food, the prices and stuff, right? <sighs> like, like, like at Domino's, you know, you can get the mix and match deal for like $5.99 each, dude. That's two like medium pizzas for $5.99 each, right? And the quality pizza is good. They got the garlic seasoning on the crust if you want. We have a Hawaiian pizza that's good. Again, the sides you get, you can get sides, complimentary items like the cheesy bread and stuff. All that stuff is good. And then there's pizza that's like one large pizza is like $15. Like, I can get two pizzas for like $12, or I can get one large pizza for like $13, $14. Which one are you taking? I, okay, so it's definitely A, right? It's not the best. <laughs> I just don't know if it goes <laughs> in front of Domino's or behind. I'm going behind Domino's, okay? I'm going behind Domino's. That's my favorite, that's fine, that's fine. Final answer, I'm going behind Domino's, okay? Whatever, this one is probably gonna roll some heads and I'm down to fight every one of you guys, it's okay. Pop eyes. Now, as far as chicken places go, right? The church's chicken we had, and KFC we had, and there's Kings. Popeyes goes right up here. Chicken sandwich is better than Chick-fil-A which is crazy for me to say, because I have Chick-fil-A at the top. But Chick-fil-A service and everything, that, that all goes with it. Popeye's sandwich is better than Chick-fil-A sandwich, okay? So that is saying something that it could do that. And also they have like the box deals and stuff, the biscuits, they are kind of dry, you need to add some money to it. But Popeye's as a whole chicken place is so good, it's so good. So for that reason, it's over Cane's, and it's in the A category, but it's not the best. It's not the best. Tillos, nope, haven't had. Potbelly, haven't had. I don't know what this is, Qdoba, haven't had. Quiznos, trash. Roy Rogers, never had. Sabaro, never had. Slotsky's. Have I had Slotsky's? Is that a donut place? Yeah, it is. Slotsky's is okay. Uh, over Papa John's. Um, Shake Shack. Damn, Shake Shack is good. Damn, Shake Shack is really good. Okay. Uh, Shake Shack. Damn, their burgers are pretty good. Fries are okay. Um, it's definitely above C. It's here somewhere. I just don't know if it's better than Culver's. I think it is. I think it's better than Culver's. I'm going here for Shake Shack. Shake Shack is a little bit better than Culver's. It edges it out. I will not, I will say this. But I've had Shake Shack, I think twice in my life. So I need to go again. Maybe I'll get something else or something off the menu. Um, but Shake Shack is pretty damn good, my guy. Not better than El Pollo Loco though. Pollo Loco, I like El Pollo Loco on it. I don't know, I don't know. Well, let's keep going, we're almost done. Sheets, never been. Skyline, never been. Sonic. 
Dude, so back in the day, right, we used to have, um, they used to be like $5 like burgers at Sonic on like Tuesdays, like a five for five thing or whatever. And we used to get that and devour it. Okay, we used to get that and devour it. Uh, Sonic is good. They have like the chili cheese um, dog. Uh, I like their, I like the chili cheese fries you can get. The mozzarella sticks are good. All the drinks you can get. The drinks are phenomenal. The nerd slushes, the um, the cherry limeades, the ocean waters. Ah, oh, dude, Sonic is pretty good. Like, Sonic is good. I'll eat Sonic. I'll eat Sonic. I would eat. I would eat Sonic. I'm not gonna lie. Um, I'm gonna do this. Here, I'm gonna do Sonic here. And then I'm gonna do, um... El Pollo Loco. I'm moving Pollo Pollo Loco to A. He has to go A. I'm sorry he's going A. El Pollo Rico is so good. It doesn't matter. It's so good. So that's that's the new thing. Okay. Steak and Shake. I don't... Uh, steak and Shake is okay. It's good. Uh, it's like... It's like... Oh my gosh. Um, it's better than IHOP. It's like better than Checkers too. Um, is it better than Dairy Queen? Yeah, it is. It is. Steak and Shake is pretty good. I'm right. Subway. Uh, okay, so here's the thing. I don't mind Subway personally. I know everybody says Subway is trash. Subway is trash, but like, I also it also gets the job done. It also kind of does what it needs to do. You know what I mean? Like, um, it's better than Quiznos. Jimmy, it's not better than Jimmy John's or Fry House Sub. It's not on that level. Um, damn. I got, I'll go here for Subway. It's better than Denny's. It's better than Jack in the Box. Ah! Uh, yeah, it's better than Jack in the Box. I'll take that. Toasted. Swinson's, haven't been. Taco Bell. Oh, man. Taco Bell, Taco Bell, Taco Bell, Taco Bell, Taco Bell. Oh, gosh. <laughs> oh, and Taco Cabana is right beside it. So can I say this? Hot take. Taco Cabana has better has better quality of food. Okay, hear me out. Hear me out. Taco Cabana has better quality of food, but I'm taking Taco Bell over Taco Cabana any day, any day, bro. Taco Bell has the bigger variety. You can get the Doritos, Locos, Tacos, whatever. You can get a quesadilla. You can get all types of stuff, bro. You can get regular tacos if you want. Bean and cheese. You can do all that. And they have the Mountain Dew Baja Blast. I don't see Taco Bell doing that. Taco Bell messes with your stomach, but it's, it's good. Okay? It's good. I'm putting Taco Bell... Is Taco Bell going in the A? <laughs> I might because Taco Bell is definitely B. Taco Bell is definitely B, okay? Um, but I'm putting Taco Bell with El Pollo. Nah, A is A has got some hitters, bro. It's not an A, but it's it's the closest thing to an A. I'm taking Taco Bell over all of these, all of these. Oh, my bad, Shake Shack. All of these things I talk about over. I don't care what y'all say. I'm taking talk about over all of those, okay? And Taco Bell, it could be, like, right uh, here. Sure. That's just me. Turkey Tacos, not that good. Uh, I'll, throw, I'll, throw, I'll throw it in. Uh, nah, 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 nah. I'll throw it in B. I'll throw it in B. It's whatever. It's whatever. Torch is not like, like, whatever. It'll get the job done, right? If I want to go get, like, some tacos somewhere or something, I just pull up and see a Torchies, you know, I'm going to be like, ah, oh, shoot. Let's get it. Let's get it. You know what I'm saying? But, like, I don't, I don't really, I'm not really messing with, with Torchies like that. I don't know. Waffle House. Now, this is some real nigga shit right here. Waffle House is on some real nigga shit, okay? Now, y'all have seen, y'all have seen, you know what I'm saying? Y'all have seen all this stuff on Twitter. Or X now, whatever the, whatever the hell they're calling it, you know what I'm saying? Y'all y'all see, y'all see the stuff that they that they be that they be saying, and the fights that be going. People catching chairs, catching bows. Listen, 
If I'm being honest with you, Waffle House actually has some banging, banging food. Okay? You go there like you go there after you're drunk, you know what I'm saying? And you you, you fade a Waffle House, whether you're in Atlanta, Houston, whatever, really it don't really matter. All the Waffle House is getting crazy, bro. You know what I'm saying? They got people playing good music in there, someone on the ox throwing in some R and B, some hip hop and stuff, you know what I'm saying? Like they like they they be doing it in Waffle House. And not for nothing, alright? Not for nothing, chat. The food is actually gas, bro. Cause you go you gonna learn. Right? You're gonna get some entertainment and you get food. They had a decent price, you know what I'm saying? It's gonna be a big W. Big W. So I'm I if I'm being honest with you, Waffle House, bro. Damn. I don't know if it's gonna I don't know if I put this in the best. I think I put it in like a high A. I'm not gonna lie, I think I put it in a high A. I think we I think I think we do high A. Better than Popeyes, better than Canes, all this all this stuff, Domino's. But uh shoot, am I going the best, bro? I'm not doing it. I'm doing I'm doing it. I'm not I'm not doing it. Wendy's. Side. Side. I'm going to go with... Uh, it's in the B again. A lot of this shit is in the B. I'll take Wendy's over... I would say the Baconator slops, though. Baconator is pretty good. Uh, I'll take Wendy's over... Over... Dairy Queen. Nah. Yeah. Yeah. Wendy's is kind of in the mix, bro. I don't really know. I don't really go to Wendy's for the Baconator. Other than that, that's pretty much it. Montego White Castle. I don't think I've had Wiener Schnitzel. Oh my gosh, that's a name I haven't heard in forever, bro. Wiener Schnitzel when it was out was good. I I'll, I'll, th I'll throw it here in the sea. It's like it's it's whatever. If I see Wiener Schnitzel, I may I may mess around and eat it. You know what I'm saying? Uh, wings over it. Never had. Here we go. Wing stop. Wing stop is the best wings. It's better than B-dubs. I don't care what you say. Wingstop is goaded. All right? They got a lot of good stuff over at Wingstop. And every time I order wings, Wingstop is my go-to. The flavors. That shit is fine. You know what I'm saying? Uh, the fries. Depending if they're extra crispy and stuff, that's fire too. You know? Uh, the different deals you can get. Wingstop, Wingstop is Wingstop is good. Zaxby's is going up next. William really Waterbury for last. Zaxby's is definitely in the A category for food joints. Um, I will throw it. I'll throw it right here. That one's pretty are synonymous. I'm gonna throw Zaxby's right here. You know what I'm saying? Just because like Zaxby's is good. I went to Zaxby's in Atlanta. That stuff was, was great. Okay, chicken is good. Flavoring is is pretty good. Um, the chicken sandwich I had was really really good. Fries are good. Everything about Zaxby's is fire. If you haven't gone to Zaxby's yet, I highly recommend you go because it's pretty pretty good. And last but not least, good old Whataburger. Now, before I get into this ranking, this has nothing to do with me living in Texas, okay? This has nothing to do with us beefing with in and out okay? This is just the solid truth. And if you haven't been to Whataburger yet, go get you some water breaker because this one is going right here right here chat it's going right here i'm not moving it i'm not doing anything it's going right here chat and that's the list that is the list chat okay this is the perfect fast food tier list American fast food tier list. And I don't have to yell because I think we all know that Waterford is the best. You know? So I'm just gonna keep my voice like this. Better than Chick fil A, better than Five Guys, better than McDonald's, better than Wingstop, better than Waffle House, better than Popeyes, Canes, Domino's, Pizza Hut, Zaxby's, whatever. Waterburger is at the top. And it's not coming down anytime soon. Thank you. Like, comment, subscribe to your boy, as this is a YouTube video. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you guys on the next two of this, okay?